The country house of the title is a house in the Berkshires in Massachusetts where a family of actors has summered for 30 years. And there are some unexpected visitors who create a kind of hothouse environment. Oh my God, stop being such a drama queen. I come by it genetically. To have Donald, a Pulitzer Prize winner, and the words that he creates, and he's a better playwright than almost anyone, I think. And then Dan Sullivan, Tony winning Dan Sullivan steering the ship. It's an embarrassment of riches. I would say that it's among the most fun experiences I've had with the company because everyone is very generous. So when you go out on stage, you're in a world of comfort and love and everybody goes a little farther because you're not afraid. I really like working with new plays because you, the director and the writer, are all sort of still figuring these people out together. There's nothing better to me on the planet than getting to get some great laughs in the beginning of the show and, and even midway through and then getting people to cry at the end. And I think Donald's just done a great job. It sort of pulls the rug out from under your feet. I wanted to write about theater people. I thought, I, I know about this world, I've inhabited it for decades now, and I wanted to try my hand at what's essentially a tradition in playwriting, the offstage comedy. It's a great fun for me to uh, poke fun at the theater and at myself on the stage. The matriarch of this family is a, an actress named Anna Patterson, played by Blythe Danner, who has had an illustrious career, much like Blythe Danner. So Blythe brings an extraordinary authenticity. She has a terrific sense of humor. She's a clown, and you'll see that in this play. The Country House is a co-production with the Geffen Playhouse in Los Angeles, and the play premiered earlier this year at the Geffen Playhouse. Four of the original cast members of The Country House who played it in Los Angeles are coming to Broadway, and Daniel Sanjata and Kate Jennings Grant are joining them, and I'm delighted that New York audiences are gonna to get to see it. I think that unfortunately, when people think of Broadway now, they think of it as being very commercial, and I'm so excited that I'm getting to make my Broadway debut in a Donald Margulies play, which is very human. And I, I think that that's a lot of what MTC does. They do very grounded human stories.